All right, here we go. Episode 7 of Show Don't Tell. Exploring video games and spirituality. I cannot believe it's already episode 7. That's crazy. So we've made it into... The city. <laughs> and uh, last time, I had quite the interesting time <laughs> trying to figure out my way over here. But what I was thinking about in between was about how, even though this game feels like it's a free-flow exploration, and even though it feels like I'm completely open to do so many things the whole point of getting to this point or everything has been up until this point guiding me here even though it doesn't necessarily feel that way and I think that that's a really important idea when we think about life in general um, that uh, we often feel like things are chaotic and they're all over the place and insanity but we really have to remember and rather, don't let ourselves forget that everything is working harmoniously in order to help us get to somewhere. So I have I have a couple of abilities here. I have the wall jump ability, and I have the air dash ability. And I also have to remember that air dash ability is ZR and not R, because I pushed R before, and R is the shooty shooty. Um, although that could be helpful to know so that I can use it, because when I try and use it with A, it doesn't work super well. Let's see if I can... Boom. No, no pogoing today. No pogoing. No. So let's explore this city a little bit. See, see what we can... Oh. I don't die in the water. <laughs> this is going to be my favorite place. <laughs> nice. Okay. Ooh, look, a nail. Lots of nails. Maybe I can upgrade my nail. Ooh. I keep doing that. That, I don't even know what happened. Mm, Have you brought me another nail to be honed? Leave it on the ground and return later if you're still uh, breathing. Ranjo Stenja. I love how these have such American, Canadian, North American English accents when they're speaking. Alright. Fix my nail. Reforge. Oh, I obviously don't have enough money. Okay. Mm. It's because I died. It's because I died before. That was last time. Now I got to get my money back. What's... Can I just... I guess like, it doesn't matter if I just drop. Because I don't die in the water. Let's take three. But I could still die here. Nothing will stop me. <laughs> if I want to kill myself. <laughs> Nothing can get in my way. That's so sad. Oh. So I think I need 250 bucks. Geo. Geo. 250 Geo. I think I was standing a little bit closer to the mic there. So I hope it wasn't too loud. Apologies. We're still learning. We're still learning. These guys remind me of the elephants in... No. Not happening. The Jungle Book. Hop! Two, three, four, and then up. Two, three, four. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Oh wee! That that's the sound, right? Oh wee! They do from the elephant trunks. Oh no! Don't get any money from that. Gotta be able to fight worm. No. Let's see if I can get a rhythm. And as I relax again, remember the voda of relaxing. Okay. What's up? What's this? 
mechanism with a simple keyhole. Okay, well, I don't have a key. I don't have a stompy stompy. Should I go up the ladder? Also, I have to remember that there were those swoopy things. Swoopy, swoopy. Ooh. What's this dust? It's like they're crying. It's so sad. Hornet! It's no surprise then you've managed to reach the heart of this world, and in so doing you shall know the sacrifice that keeps it standing. But we don't even know why we're here. What's going on? This is also like a really sophisticated city. Like, what's going on that everybody's insanity? I guess that's the story. If, knowing that truth, you'd still attempt to roll in Hallow Nest's perpetuation, seek the grave in Ash, and the market would grant one like you. Okay, so it's called Hallow Nest, because Hallow is a uh, religious y word for important, I think. Hollow Knight. In the black vault far above, through its sacrifice, Hallow Nest lasts, e lasts eternal. So, the Hollow Knight is in the Black Vault protecting Hallow Nest, right? Black Egg Temple added. Is there like a big map that I can look at? Big map? Big. Yeah, okay. Let's see here. Okay, so I'm in the city. Dirt Mouth. Forgotten Crossroads. Oh, that black thing! That looks like that helmet. Okay, I've seen this before. I know some stuff. I know some stuff. Oh, there's a door there. I can't go there. Can I climb up here? Is this another? Can I make that? I don't think so. Yeah, nope. Not happening. Okay. So, so. So there was an elevator here that I missed, so I can go to that elevator. This guy's important. We gotta go find him. I don't know why I have to find him. I don't even know why I care. Why do I care? Why do I care so much? What is the source that makes us so curious? Why are people so curious? Oh. No, so do a lever. It's a lever. Okay. Really? Is that it? This music switches from being happy to sad. There's something happy about this place, but it's also sad that it's empty and cryy and sad and rainy. Although I do kind of like rain, being that I am from Vancouver. Vancouver being a rainforest. Okay, so I can't get up there. There's for sure a double jump, but I'm gonna have to. Oh. Did I go this way already? I did. This is the way to the nail guy. So I'm gonna get 250 Geo, and I'm going to go and upgrade my nail. Because. There's 250 right there. You know, I need to keep reminding myself, and every time I finish a, uh, a recording, I think, you know, it's such a good experience to be putting myself out here like this vulnerably. I realize I'm actually not posting them yet. I'm just doing a couple of recordings in a row, so I make sure that they're not abysmally bad, but I probably should just start putting them out today. Uh, and just at least the first one and see what happens with the YouTube algorithm. But that, that the whole point of this exercise is to use the tools that I supposedly have in order to uh, practice outside. And if I'm supposed to be confidently uh, learning this way, that. what a hypocrite. <laughs> All right, let's reforge this nail.
Jonesha. As you wish. I'll get to work then. Dun, 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 dun. That's a pretty cool cutscene. Garadel Akari. What is this? It sounds like like an American person speaking a foreign language. There we go. The reforging is complete. I should say an, a Canadian person. An Anglo. An Anglo. I'm so used to, from in our Hebrew speaking universe, the accent, the English speaking, North American English speaking accent is the American accent as opposed to the Canadian or North American accent. Yeah, take that. Oh, it hit him twice. Cool. Did I do something different? I don't think so. Oh, that hit him in one shot. Mad with the power. Okay, so now that my nail is stronger. So does this mean that I... Okay, I think I went everywhere. No, I didn't. I definitely didn't. Go away. Ha ha ha, I'm so powerful. Right, so I don't know if I'm supposed to do this, but why not? It's so easy, it's right there. So accessible. All right. The money, and go the money, and fight the monsters, and get the money. Okay, so these guys should take two hits now. Okay, so this is all single jump land. So they shouldn't be expecting me, oops, to need a double jump here. Whoa, 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 bro. Back off. That worked. Now I feel slightly less incompetent. There's platform here. Something is happening. Uh, yes. You know, interestingly enough, it still feels laggy. Oh. Like, I'm just in the rhythm of it and not rushing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I can pogo on him. Pogo. Which requires pogo the timing. Or just brute force. You know, that reminds me, though. One of the most valuable lessons I remember learning when I was working in uh, doing some manufacturing work, the difference between going fast and rushing. So we often feel like, at least I was conditioned to think, that going fast meant intensity, like, Ugh! oh, nice. Okay, here we go. There was a certain intensity associated with speed, and you don't need actually that. You don't actually need that. Oh. Yeah. Okay, a store. Velmi Artrit. Velmi Artrit. Besader. These journals give us an interesting glimpse in the minds and hearts of those who lived before us. I think this is the key that I need to get further. I'll pay a modest price for them. Oh, maybe do I sell? I'm confused. He buys my things? Borison Gian. Oh! Brain is broken. Yeah, no, I don't want to sell that right now. Um, okay, let's see. I think I could go higher, right? Could I go higher? Yes. Just because I died, and I know that I will eventually want to sell. And I will want the... Uh... 
Whoa, bro. That was scary. Okay. <laughs> when I walk, the pages go up. Is that what happened? This place has been uninhabited for a long time. Actually, no, but what about all these marching soldier guys? Oh, this will be fun, right? Can I do it? Nope, it will not work. Oh, no. Heal first. <sighs> Playing it close to the chest, man. Really close to the chest. Oh, great. A wall hoppy. Oh, it's a flying one. Those are like... I was gonna say less annoying. But I'm... Oh my god! Okay, let's see. Is there some way that I can get health back? Because I don't remember... No, where the bench was... But I don't want to have to go all the way back if I don't absolutely lutely have to. Ooh. I walked and missed it. Okay. There. Okay, there's a shooty flyy dude. Can we explode. I'm lucky I saw it. Okay, so this, this should be a straightforward exercise. Oh, uh, really? <laughs> not enough, not enough to get a heal in there. Okay, okay, I hear you. Spiky, spiky, we're just living on the edge, man. Where's our bench? Oh, this isn't so bad. So can I dash over him? Yes. Yes. Oh, I can also go there, but I don't want to push my luck. Don't push your luck. Can't think of any words that rhyme in a way that I want to rhyme on the stream. All right. There we go. That I did not see them. Whew. What is this? Rancid egg. And he's over there. Oh, I have to go to the thingy. Ha <laughs> ha I have to do the whole cycle again. Okay. I'll take it. To the... Oi. It's to the right. Which means I have to go all the way around, I'm guessing. Okay, so then... That will be here. No, not here. This is the way that I had to go to the left. It was not super happy. Oh, 
Oh, nice. Okay, so they only take four attacks. I should have been counting that from before. That's fine. Here's the hoppy. Imagine if I hadn't upgraded my nail, how hard that would be. <sighs> so approaching life obstacles, like we approach a video game. Looking for advantages. Not being dissuaded or demotivated. Labeling experiences as learning as opposed to failure. What else have we got? Any ideas? Whoa! Explode. He was in the shadows, was he not? There's going to be a place, by the way, where there's going to be... Aha! things that comes up while I'm fighting something. Oh, you can do other angles? I'm not getting involved in that. Oh, that's what I want. There we go. Both sides. That's, that's very nice. Thank you. Extremely generous of you. All right, the shadow. See, this should be a, a simple matter of a pogo. Oh, I still have to hit him twice. All right, all right. I'm not going to be greedy. Okay, I can climb on the glass. Nice. This is a very big tower. Ooh, there's a bench. Let's just let's just do the bench. Not gonna be greedy. Oh, but there's a caterpillar. Can I shoot this? No. Oh, I don't have. Caterpillar and friends. We should have a theme song for that. I need a person who's the theme song person. Who's my theme song person? Send me a theme song. This is not where we're going. We're going to a bench. Where's our bench? 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 Oh, okay. Really? That's unfortunate. Watch the bench have been in the other room, by the way. The dissonance. It's beautiful, but also haunting. Fire comes in. One, two. You know what that reminds me of actually? The cacophony of sound is the minds of Moria at the very beginning. I should rewatch those, but the part where when Gimli introduces to the welcome to the Mines of Moria business and it's like, wow, this place is amazing, but it's completely empty. What's going on? This is kind of like that. It's majestic and palatial because it's a palace, I suppose, and beautiful and also haunting. Right, 
So then I go up again. The bench way. Let's go to the bench way. This was the thing from before. Ba -ba 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 -ba. It's gonna start the thing. That is not fair. Oh, really? What's a guy to do? What do you think I should do? What am I supposed to do? What should I do? Oh, the other thing from this violin section or string section is da 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 da. Anyone remember that one? At least I was able to get my shadow. This is like a really bad place to have died. In the middle of a mini boss. Although, the upside is I'm going to get very good at their timings and understanding their attack patterns. So if I look at it as an opportunity in disguise, that's a quote from my father, every problem is an opportunity in disguise. This is an opportunity in disguise to do at least two things. One is to calm down and keep my head. That's the most important skill I think that we ever will learn in our adult lives is how to keep our heads because if we can go thoughtfully and fast but not rushing right that's the thing that's what I was saying before ah go fast and rushing are not the same we think that we need to rush <laughs> because for some reason I don't know if it's like PE class or whatever I'm sorry Mr. Kefalas because this wasn't from you it's not PE class but the PE class way of life is not the way that we su we're supposed to go. But being fast means efficient. And being efficient actually could mean being uh, slow and purposeful. Um, my drum teacher when I was in high school, and I'm going to remember Dan. What was Dan? Dan, what was your last name? I'm sorry. Um, one of the most important teachers that I had in my life, incidentally, because of this, he, we, he, he taught us about... Um, if you can do it really slow, okay. If you can do it really slow, then you can also do it. Oh, there we go. Okay, if you can do it really slow and you understand all of the parts, then you can do it fast. So do it really slow. So slow that it's annoying. And understand every piece of the flow. And when you understand every piece of the flow, then you get the outcome that you want. Just like this. Mr. Map Man. And now I'm just, I'm, I'm past it and I forgot about the past and the struggle and the embarrassment even though it will be published for the world to see for all time. Hey, we're finding this place together incidentally. That's pretty cool. Because he's never been here before and he's just making the map for the first time. A toll machine with the symbol of a bench. <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, there we go. Well, we're at 29 minutes. This was great. City of Tears. We've explored a tremendous amount of this place. All right, there's the shop. There's the selling shop. There's the other bench. And here we go. Well, thank you for joining me on episode 7 of Show Don't Tell's Playthrough of Hollow Knight. Please like and subscribe and ding the bell if you want to see our episode updates. And looking forward to next time.